Well guys, welcome back to the channel. Finally, I'm showing my face for like... I didn't show like for two months or something. I didn't have an attention to. Today, uh, I have a pretty special video. Today, we're going to be trying uh, to design how Godzilla can look like in a new movie that is coming out in November. So, we only have this like concept drawing right here of logo of the movie. That's the only info that we have on this movie so far. So, um, yeah, this, this is going to be hard. This is going to be really hard. And I have already got some drawings right here. And uh, yeah. So as you can see right here, I have first started sketching the head because, um, in my opinion, the head is one of the it's one of the biggest things when I look at a Godzilla design. Every design so far had a different design of a head and different expression, really. And uh, as I said in this video, I will be focusing on Millennium design. So I've added uh, a little bit of an ear there. Uh, because ear, I, in my opinion, the ears are really important in a Godzilla design. If you want the character to look a bit more badass, then a big eyebrow like Millennium had. And that quirky little smile, uh, the smile, I kind of got it from like, 54. I mean, I know we didn't have like a smile, but you know, it's, uh, this, this head design is a little bit snake-like, but I like it pretty much. As you can see, like, uh, the spikes are already coming out of its, uh, like, mid-eyebrow area. And, uh, I haven't drew any eyeballs, so, um, yeah. And uh, yeah, that's kind of a head design. I think it turned out to be pretty good. And yeah, let's move on to uh, the tail. Oh, uh, here's the tail. Um, I had I, I had a long discussion with myself um, about this one. I have decided to go with the spiky one, the, the spiky design of uh, the Dorsha blades and the tail. Tail, yeah, normal tail that you would see, pretty long, I would say. Uh, I prefer longer tails than Godzilla designs. Um, and as you can see right here, there is a little bit... The door shells are kind of disappearing. And then they're reappearing on the quite end of the tail. That's something that I would really like to see in the Godzilla design in the movie. Uh, and uh, yeah, spikes are kind of suitable for this one, because as you can see on this only image that we got... Uh, the Godzilla, it seems like he has spiky dorsals. If this image right here represents an actual Godzilla from the movie. And I have also drew this one uh, with the uh, old 54 dorsals and Heisei dorsals. And uh, yeah, I, I don't think either of them are bad. To be, to be honest, both, both are pretty good. But I the, for this design, I have decided to go with uh, the spiky ones. And I, I think I won't regret. So, for the final uh, details that I'm going to add, is Heisei belly and arms. Like, arms are a little bit fatter and bigger. And uh, belly is, you know, that, like, original Japanese Heisei belly that we got to see a lot. And I, yeah, it's pretty normal at Godzilla design so far. I've added, uh, this, like, Shin Godzilla's wide legs. You know how some Godzilla have really wide legs. Shin Godzilla has a really wide legs, as you can see right here, and I have decided to add that. Uh, since I think this Godzilla is going to be not that slimmer, but I hope it gets a little bit bigger. I like chunky ones. This image, it really seems like Godzilla is a little bit uh, chunkier. And also for, for the touch, for the ending touch, I have added Millennium Throat Spikes, which are these little spikes that are appearing at a uh, Millennium Design uh, from 2000 and uh, after 2001, like Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla and that, you know, that version of Millennium. So I, I, I find that uh, those spikes are pretty interesting and I would love to see them on this design. So what does actual design look like? Well, I'm finally done with the design.
Okay, yes, this is the design of the Godzilla, potential one, obviously. So, as you can write to you right here, it's pretty chunky. Uh, of course, the, like, um, spiky dorsal plates, I think they are fitting. I think they're pretty much fitting. Then we have that, um, those wide legs. I know they're not that wide, but you know what? I prefer them wider. And they're not as big as Shin Godzilla, but you know, also it has a pretty long tail, a uh, spiky tail, actually, which is, um, I don't know why I put that there, to be honest, uh, and the face, obviously, yeah, I, I may, maybe made it a little bit chunkier, I mean, maybe, maybe, maybe the face is a little bit wider, but you see what I mean, like, spikes are going, uh, I mean, spikes are having a little bit bigger range than expected. So, um, yeah, hands obviously hasty, a bit bigger, claws, yeah, I'll add a claws because it's Godzilla and I think that Godzilla should have claws. So, yeah, this is the design, hopefully like it, maybe I'll make some more uh, designs. If you guys like this video and if it reaches, I don't know, 1k subscribers since my channel is falling a little bit, Hopefully you like this one. So that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one.